everyone. Thanks for stopping again at Ask Guitar Pro. This is Jake. Uh, we're going to continue with uh, our guitar technique discussions, and today we're going to talk a little bit about vibrato. And <clears throat> I don't know about you, but most of the guitar players that are in my top 10 favorite, top 20 favorite list, whatever, all have a really um, good vibrato. You know, vibrato, I think, stand uh, really helps guitar uh, playing stand out, too. It just kind of sweetens up overall guitar playing, you know, similar to the other phrasing things we've talked about, like sliding, um, hammer-ons and pull-offs, vibrato can be very important in a, in a given solo or a guitar passage. So, you know, it's, it's very straightforward. If you, if you haven't really ever employed vibrato, you can do it with a number of fingers. Um, probably the most common fingers for myself are my ring finger on my hand, uh, on my left hand, and then my uh, index finger. So, of course, if I play with the uh, ring finger, it would sound something like this. And go back to the index finger. So, what I want to point out here is that, um, especially when I play with the index finger, instead of going um, up and down the strings like this with my hand, I actually kind of do a rotating motion. Um, and I think this just makes it easier to play the vibrato, and I, and I think this is probably how uh, more players do it. But it's a little different when you play with your ring finger because you're actually kind of pulling up and down versus being able to swivel your hand when you play with your index finger. So the motion's a little different. that you can do that's that's kind of cool sounding too or bend I should say a vibrato and that's when you're at the peak of a bend okay so uh, for example I'm doing it here with my ring finger <laughs> Generally, I like the technique when you come off of a note, uh, a bend or something, and come back to a vibrato. You hear a lot of players incorporate that in, your pl in their playing. <laughs> Just a general note, it's tough to get <clears throat> a vibrato on the high E string because uh, if, you, if you're keeping it fretted down and you're moving back and forth, you're of course coming off the fretboard. So uh, normally it's a lot easier to get vibrato if you're bending, especially if you're pulling the string uh, towards this part of the guitar, guitar up. <laughs> So that's just obviously a quick uh, vibrato demo there. Yet another arsenal you can use in your overall phrasing and, and playing. Uh, 
uh, especially soloing. So, hey, check out more gear reviews and extras online at the website at www.askaguitarpro.com. I'm Jake. We'll catch everyone next time. Take care.